So, uh, I'm making this video a lot earlier than I should, because Scythedance, or like Scythe Pants, said, yeah, no update for a minute, and I have no idea how long that's gonna take, because last update was like in the middle of March, so like, I'm not waiting any longer. So, uh, reason one is a red flag. Shit failed mods. I was not having to with the last update, I dropped my thoughts on it saying it was lackluster, and this guy was like, hey, shut the fuck up or else I'll ban you. And I'm like, okay, I'm like the only active content creator in this, like, struggling game, and you're like, wanting to ban me. So yeah, I'm hanging up my, uh, my trench coat and I'm leaving this bitch. And it wasn't only me, it was some other guy. So, uh, Siphons, pick your mods better. Like, remove this guy's mod powers, please. And the fact we already have moderators that don't like or, like, take criticism, it already shows that there won't be any room for improvement at all. I mean, the game is already hyper-balanced as hell. Like, whatever else you're paying for is just, like, reskins of the Crucible, bruh. Like, you can already tell this game's gonna be a cosmetic hell slop fest because a little bit of unbalancing makes the game fun. Let's just say, I don't know, Forza. Someone pulls up in a goddamn Jesco and someone pulls up in, like, a what? A shitbox Supra? You think the Jesco would win? <laughs> Wrong. The super wins that. Why? Because the player behind the goddamn wheels was good as shit. In Combat Wars, you could see, like, level 10 players with Dragon Slayer and their suck ass. So I don't see what's the problem with, like, a little bit of unbalanced weapons, bro. So yeah, this game was fun for, like, the month it lasted. But yeah, I'm leaving until, like, Scythe fans get this shit together. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in another video.